Hello everyone, in this tutorial we will create this shutter effect that you see on the screen in After Effects. You can use this effect on your text as well as your logo. Here we are in After Effects and we start by creating a new composition with the standard settings 1920 by 1080 frame rate by 30, duration 5 seconds, background color black. And we are gonna name this main for our main composition. This will be our main composition. So now we want to select horizontal type tool and type in our text you can type in whatever you want and the font i'm using for this is called montserrat bold size is 250 now we want to go to align and align this into the center and we go to effects and presets type in shutter and apply it to the text so double click on it and now here on this panel we change this view to rendered and then we go to shape open the settings change this pattern to glass and then we are going to change this extrusion depth to zero and close this open force one change strength to 0 0.5 and now go to physics change gravity to 0 and so far we have created this so let's have a look at it looking good so we are going to copy this shutter effect that we created so ctrl c and then go to text layer ctrl shift c to pre-compose it and name it shutter click ok and we paste it to this new composition with the text on it so ctrl v to paste the effect to it now go to shape and change pattern to stars and triangles and change extrusion depth to 0 0.1 and now go to force one close this go to force one and then change strength to one now for radius we go to two seconds and set a keyframe to it and then change it to 0 0.1 now go to 3 seconds and then change it to 0 0.8 now press U to view the keyframes and select the two of them and press F9 to easy ease them so we got something like that now close the settings and duplicate this layer so ctrl d to duplicate it and go to shape change this pattern set this to glass back to glass and change extrusion depth to 0 0.2 now go to force one and go to two seconds where we set our first keyframe so press u to view it and then change radius to 0 0.15 and then change strength to 0 0.5 and now we close this duplicate it again ctrl d duplicate this layer and then we go to physics and change this mass variance to 50 percent and that should be it for this tutorial so let's have a look at it
That's it for this tutorial, I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video as well, and see you on the next video.